Kia ora peeps, I'm uh, Bodin Thompson and I'm from Ngāti Ranginui. I'm fighting in the uh, Mahindra Super 8 on November 3rd and uh, be fighting Paul Gallant. It was one of those things I guess, um, I just got asked and um, yeah, just kind of couldn't turn it down. Uh, it's just an opportunity, you know, to, to keep fit and, um, and a great op opportunity for me and um, a challenge, so it was something that I couldn't turn down. When you come up against someone like um, Paul, you know, he's reached the, the heights, you know, played for his country in New South Wales and captain, you know, he's going to be a tough opponent. It's just one of those things that I've got to be at my best and uh, hopefully all goes well. Yeah, training's been good. They kind of train uh, here at City Boxing, uh, you know, the same as the NRL do. They a couple times a day and, uh, you know, they've got some professional fighters here that trip. This is all they do. And, um, it's been different because, you know, with league training there's a lot of powerlifting and, uh, you know, there's a lot of uh, field work and wrestle and stuff like this, but in here it's, you know, it's pretty much just uh, you're throwing punches every day and um, you know, everything, everything was totally new to me, and, but I'm really enjoying it. It's kind of like a, a breath of fresh air, just trying to learn as much as I can. Odin is looking very, very good. We're just going to work on, on general skills. I mean, the guy, um, he knows how to fight. Um, so I got a feeling that Bowden and, and Paul Gillen might steal the show on the night. Both two very competitive um, athletes. I'm happy with his training and, and his discipline and willing to learn. It, it's, it's amazing. Yeah, look, I'm very impressed with Bowden. He's only been uh, training for about three weeks. Um, but as you would expect, he's training really hard. He's improved out of sight, man. And um, I think lucky for Paul Gallen that he's only had three weeks and not the eight weeks that you normally get going into this because he's a natural and um, he's, he's looking very good. Coming from a team sport into an individual sport is always hard. Uh, it's good that we've been training together. Um, on the day, um, he won't be having any subs to um, help him out in, in the ring. Uh, he's been accountable, he's been working hard. It's been a privilege uh, training alongside him, seeing what he's done inspiring. He respects the sport and, man, I think he's going to be a fierce competitor. Obviously, you know, everyone was disappointed about how the season ended um, this year and uh, it's definitely something that we want to, you know, take personal and um, make sure we want to finish it in, in, a, in the top four next year and that's going to be a real, you know, focus for us and, yeah, the boxing, you know, it'll help me because, you know, they're, gonna, they're taking away an extra sub or a couple of subs next year and, you know, I really want to be a, um, an 80 minute player and a force to be reckoned with in our team and, you know, I want to do the best to, to my ability so, uh, being that extra, extra little bit of fit, you know, it's not going to hurt.